All right, it is the moment of truth, Ryan. Please reveal your master canvas. Hi, Ryan, tell us about this. Well, um, Kelly assigned me 90s New School um, because it's the opposite of what I normally do. And uh, I feel like she assigned it to me because uh, she basically wanted me to prove that if I deserve the Ink Master title, I should be able to you know, tackle any style and handle any challenge that was thrown at me. So um, I think you know, this challenge was the opposite of what I've been expected to do, and I, you know, did it as as true to the challenge as I could. Um, I trained with uh, coil machines for a few weeks before I attempted it. Um, I started using steel tubes, um, and I practiced before I even attempted it. And uh, the artwork took me a very long time. Um, okay. I mean, aside from just uh, Ryan, I gotta move it along. I gotta move it along. Oliver, let's hear from you. Well, I gotta say, man, this was one tough challenge for you especially. I mean, this style is something that you weren't even tattooing when this style was prevalent. I remember the 90s. I remember tattooing at tattoo conventions with Clean Rock when he was doing all this stuff. And I mean, this, this is it. You could go, this is a time machine tattoo right here. You know, you go back. tattoo is done, the line work, the color, the solid, the bright, the color play of making the chrome with the weird highlights, nailed it. Chris, your thoughts? Well, you know, this tattoo, it really, it does exude 90s. It does have that really 90s feel. I also, this is my 25th year tattooing, I grew up on this. So looking at this artwork, the outline quality, the color quality, the color palette and play, it really sets off a strong 90s presence. What for me really hits it is the use of the chrome because we were really chrome babies in the 90s. We would make anything chrome and you captured that look in this 90s field tattoo. I think you did a great job. Thank you. All right, Ryan, thank you very much.